Ay, 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 I see some drops of rain and those clouds. Well, let's see. Let's see. Ay, ay, ay. I can hear the lightning. And so here we are. The day after the rain. It rained a lot last night. You can see the paddle here in the middle. And so here today the guys are pumping the water out of uh, the lake. We are right at the base of the lake, right in the bottom. They've been placing the liner for the past uh, three days now. And the only thing that uh, slowed uh, the process down was the rain. The rain didn't do much damage, I must say. It's more than anything, is the rain is slowing down the works, that's all. Because since everything is very soft, the soil is very soft, the excavators have to be more careful. So, as you can see on one side, uh, they continuing with the, um, uh, setting the liner. And on the other side, they haven't excavated enough and they haven't made the soil smooth for the liner to be placed because they haven't finished making this concrete base for the water dam on one end of the lake. This side is ready for the water dam, but on the other side, they're still making the concrete. And so they can't excavate because they need a ramp for the excavators to go down and up. It looks like it's not going to rain for a few more days at least. It's gonna just stay cloudy for a few days. And this is ideal, optimal for um, the works to continue and to go fast because it's not so hot, but yet it's dry. So they are working full on to uh, gain the time that they have lost because of the rain. This material here is called geotextile. It's, um, it feels like cotton, it's a bit spongy. And um, so the way they're placing the liner is like this. There's first a layer of geotextile, then the liner itself, which is the waterproof material, and then another layer of the geotextile. Why? Because this layer, which is at the very bottom, protects, give a, a kind of protection to the liner against the stones, then the liner, which is the waterproof material, the main one, and then another layer of uh, geotextile on top, because in the lake there will be placed some um, uh, stones, some rocks and uh, plants, so to give an extra protection. So a protection on the bottom, a protection on the top. It's uh, basically like a sandwich. It is extremely bright uh, walking on this geotextile. <laughs> it feels like, it looks like I'm walking on snow, but uh, in reality it's very hot here and also very, very bright. It kind of blinds my eyes if I look at it. And so to make a long story short, they are placing the first Lego blocks. Look at that. Look at that. 